you know in india everybody is in a hurry to graduate and get a job you know after having spent 25 years in iit is when i saw and understood about the practice school concept it's a very unique concept you know, i have seen bits alumni who have won oscars and i have seen bits alumni who have done very well in academics so what is up guys kaise aap sabhi log to aaj ke is video mein main aapko milane wala hu bits pilani ke respected vice chancellor se 2016 se 2022 tak sir ne iit delhi ke director ke roop mein kaam kiya tha aur ab 2023 mein kuch mahine pehle sir ne bits pilani jo सकते हो तो ऑन्टरप्रनोरशिप उसके बारे में सर के क्या थॉट्स हैं? बिट साइड एक्सपीरियंस के लिए जेई एक्सपीरियंस के लिए सर का क्या संदेश है सो सिट बैक रिलैक्स एंड एंजॉय द वीडियो गुड इवनिंग सर प्लीज पहले थोड़ा हमारी ऑडियंस को बताइए अपने बारे में थोड़ा सा आई एम वी राम गोपाल राव आई स्टार्टेड माय करियर एज ए फैकल्टी मेंबर इन आई आई टी बॉम्बे आई स्पेंट एटीन ईयर्स एज ए प्रोफेसर इन आई आई टी बॉम्बे देन आई मूव टू आई आई टी डेली एज ए डायरेक्टर दैट वॉज इन टू थाउजेंड एंड सिक्सटीन माई टर्म एंडेड इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू फेब्रुवरी एंड आई जॉइन बिट्स नाउ आफ्टर अबाउट एयर एंड आई एम करेंटली विद बिट सिस्टम मैनेजिंग द फाइव कैंपस एज ए ग्रुप वाइस चांसलर बट आई ऑपरेट आउट ऑफ द पिलानी कैंप सर आपको क्या डिफरेंसेस और क्या सिमिलरिटीज लगी आईआईटी के वर्किंग स्टाइल में और बिट्स पिलाने के वर्किंग स्टाइल में देयर आर मेनी सिमिलरिटीज दैट वे द क्वालिटी ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स इज प्रीटी गुड इन बिट्स द एडमिशंस आर वेरी ट्रांसपेरेंट एंड बिट्स डजंट हैव एनी रिजर्वेशन सिस्टम देयरफॉर स्टूडेंट्स टेंड टू बी विद इन अ वेरी नैरो बैंड ऑफ मेरिट एंड इवन द इन टर्म्स ऑफ द गर्ल्स परसेंटेज बिट्स हैज आई वुड से सिमिलर परसेंटेज ऑफ गर्ल्स हैज इन आईआईटी सो व्हिच इज आल्सो अ गुड साइन द स्टूडेंट्स आर ब्राइट एंड वी आर आल्सो रिक्रूटिंग लॉट of good faculty in fact in bits right now every second faculty member is somebody who would have joined in the last 6 years we have about 930 faculty members in all the campuses and half of them will be in the age group of 30 to 35 so i think with so many young people joining the institution as faculty with very diverse interests and expertise from different places i think you know there is a lot of potential that bits can derive out of their experience so we are trying to put in place multiple mechanisms provide funding to them to ensure that all of these people will be able to realize their potential and focus on education focus on research and focus on innovation iit delhi is known for its innovation iit delhi is actually ranked number 1 in the country today uh, when it comes to alumni startups and after iit delhi comes iit bombay then actually comes the bits pilani bits on the other hand has grown quite rapidly in fact with five campuses and uh, with over almost 18000 students now so it's a very diverse system in different countries so when it comes to administration it poses its own challenges because not everything happens in one campus like in iit delhi and because we have so many campuses sometimes uh, the issues are different so we need to manage that but there is a proper system in place bits is a 60 year old institution so many processes have been in place when it comes to the organizational structure so i think it has its own challenges it has its own advantages so i think overall it's a very interesting kind of a system right now glad to hear that sir this shows ki you know there are a lot of similarities and lot of differences as well जो कि अपने अपने मेरिट्स के साथ आते हैं देर आर लॉट ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स जो कि जेई के लिए प्रिपेयर कर रहे हैं या फिर बिट्स के लिए प्रिपेयर कर रहे हैं तो उन एक्सपीरियंस के लिए जो आईआईटी बिट्स पिलानी स्पेशली जो बिट्स ज्वाइन करना चाहते हैं हु हैव दे लाइक ड्रीम कॉलेजेस बिट्स पिलानी सो उनको आप क्या मैसेज देना चाहोगे बिट्स इज वन इंस्टीट्यूट वेयर देर इज लॉट ऑफ इनोवेशन वेन इट कम्स टू करिकुलम यू नो स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम द इनिशियल स्टेजेस बिट्स हैज फॉलोड अ वेरी फ्लेक्सिबल काइंड ऑफ ए करिकुलम बिट्स ऑल्सो फॉलोज द जीरो अटेंडेंस पॉलिसी सो वी ट्रस्ट द स्टूडेंट्स हु कम टू अवर कैंपस we expect that they realize their potential and of course they also find their passions you know they can try out so many things there are so many activities that are happening all the time and they can try out where they are good at and then decide their future career options you know i have seen bits alumni who have won oscars and i have seen bits alumni who have done very well in academics and i have also seen bits alumni who have built uh, deca cons and what the students are good at is what they can find after coming to a place like that and with the given
given the zero attendance policy, given the flexibility in the curriculum, in fact, what the national education policy has prescribed in 2020 is what BITS has been following for over 50 years in a way. Now, if you look at the national education policy, many of those recommendations in the NEP are what BITS had as a part of their curriculum way back in when it got started. I think that credit goes to the founders. In fact, BITS had that collaboration with MIT in the US and there were many MIT faculty who stayed in Pilani and designed the curriculum, helped the institute to actually get started. So I think some of those initial measures that they had taken have really taken BITS this far. So now I think BITS is doing pretty well when it comes to education. BITS is doing very well. On the research front, there are almost like 1800 students right now, 1800 PhD students and many patents are getting filed. We are looking at you know 100 patents per year as a target starting from next year. It's all possible. I mean, looking at the potential of students, looking at the potential of faculty, BITS has also generated almost 400 crores of funding from various government of India agencies. So that again is giving a major boost to the, the research activities and we will soon be announcing some major initiatives involving the alumni and many alumni are coming forward and funding centers of excellence on the campus. So I think BITS has a huge potential and BITS is at its inflection point I would say. Being in a private sector, BITS also has a lot of flexibilities which many government institutions will not have. So therefore taking the best from the government institutions, taking the best from what a private institution can offer, I think BITS has the potential to go beyond any institution in the country. Fantastic. So that gave me goosebumps, you know. As a vice chancellor, you are managing five campuses. Kis tarike ka apka kaam rehta hai? Matlab, thoda sa agar aap uske baare mein batana chahe ki your responsibilities as the vice chancellor. Yeah, I only look at the policies that impact all the campuses. So I don't get into the day-to-day -day administration of any of these campuses. For example, you know, the recently we made a policy. We want to support more student startups here. There are more innovation among the students. So we are putting in place a policy where how do we fund a lot of student projects across all these campuses. The bits in Mumbai is more in management and the law kind of discipline so I don't really get involved too much there but in the remaining four campuses so we are always looking at how do you support more student projects. Many of these projects can really take off and then develop some technologies or orient their work towards problems which have a societal relevance. So I think so we are putting in place a kind of a scheme to fund those startups or similarly faculty innovation. Now for deep technology can of companies, faculty need to play a role. You know, we have just announced a program where we are trying to connect faculty from across the campuses to work together in an interdisciplinary kind of an area. Because future of innovation will happen at the intersection of different disciplines. What you can do in a given discipline is already, you know, pretty much achieved. But therefore, the future innovation will happen at the intersection of different disciplines. And that is where we are now launching schemes to fund faculty across these campuses. While every campus has a director who is also a very eminent faculty member, a professor many of them have also come from IITs to be the directors here. Those aspects are all managed at the campus level. So that is where I spend uh, most of my time. One last question, sir. Jaise BITS ne recently ek policy start kari. I think no other Indian campus has that. PS system to bahut pehle se hai, but ek recent policy BITS ki aai hai ki you can take a gap year for pursuing entrepreneurship. So if you want to pursue entrepreneurship, aap beech mein ek saal ka gap year le sakte hai. So what are your thoughts on that? And how can students make the best use of it? These are very much required. You know, in India, every Everybody is in a hurry to graduate and get a job. In the US system, it doesn't happen like that. In developed countries, you want to pursue multiple interests. People even take a break to just travel to different countries, come back and continue that. I think people need to do that, not just go after that rote learning and just, you know, finish the degree, get this job. I think Indians, all of us, you know, that happened to us and that's happening to current generation. We're all in a hurry to, you know, complete something. I think we should sit back, look at all the options, you know, learn different things and, you know, try out different things. This is the time for anyone to do that. So that gap year is a great idea and I'm very happy that we have been able to do that in BITS and uh, even the practice school concept in BITS is very unique. You know, after having spent 25 years in IITs, when I saw and understood about the practice school concept, it's a very unique concept. Every year, almost 3,500 students are getting placed in companies, paid internships, all arranged by the institution and that is not very easy to do for any institution to replicate that. That gives students the real life experience of 
you know how industries work and that at that age is very important that will also help them to decide their future career options bits also does another thing very effectively the work integrated learning programs today over 30000 students from different industries registered for degrees in bits so they are all taking courses online right examinations and some of them are even working for bachelor's degree by staying in their company so that's again very unique and over 30000 students are currently enrolled for different degrees or diplomas in bits from different industries that also gives us a lot of connect with these industries we are also trying to see now how to exploit those connections with industries for more you know research opportunities for more industry oriented research now that's also something we are looking so wilps are like diplomas as say jo all students pursue it wilp can also be a be degree it can be be it can be diploma these are all online kind of programs and people can do it like simultaneously kisi aur cheez ke sath kar sakte that's fantastic it was great talking to you sir we got a lot of insights anything else you would like to share all the best and i look forward to interacting with students more and more i have been here only for just over a couple of months now i would like to interact with more students uh, as part of my job here wishing you all the best sir for your amazing journey ahead so thank you thanks a lot thank you thank you thank you